Want to make a realistic water vortex in Blender? Here's how. Select the interface of the glass, duplicate it, and separate it. Then, turn it into your water mesh. Add a cube around everything. This will be your fluid domain. In the Physics tab, set it to Liquid Domain. Set the resolution value to 96 for a more realistic and accurate simulation. Make the water mesh a flow object. Set the flow type to liquid and the flow behavior to geometry. Set the glass as a collision effector. This will allow the liquid to stay inside the glass. Add a vortex force field. Set the vortex shape to point. Lower the strength value. Animate the vortex force to gradually lose strength and prevent the fluid from overflowing. Rebake the simulation and playback. Animate the particle radius to gradually lose volume in the simulation. After baking, you'll notice that the fluid returns to its original level. To fix the rough surface of the liquid, animate the smoothing positive and negative values in the mesh panel. Add realistic glass and water shaders, an environment texture for lighting, and render with cycles for stunning results. Boom! Realistic Whirlpool in Blender. Like and follow for more Blender tutorials.